I've been trying to do it right. Hey! I've been living a lonely life. Huh. I've been sleeping here instead. Hey! I've been sleeping in my bed. Today I am teaching you how to get this hairstyle. It's called Milkmaid Braids. It's um, a hairstyle that I can remember my whole life, you know, being around. And um, the other day I posted my Coachella side braid and somebody requested for me to do this and I thought, why not? It's just like a really cool um, kind of girly hairstyle and this weekend is Coachella. This is a perfect Coachella hairstyle. I mean, come on. Bohemian, right? Hippie, flower child, whatever you want to call it, but it's fun. So I'm going to show you how to get this. It's so easy that you're not even going to believe it. If so, if you don't know how to do it, keep watching. I'm going to show you step by step how I got this. Here we go. So I started with just parting my hair directly down the middle, all the way down the back and separating it into two sides. And I'm going to just braid each side, regular braid, but I'm going to start behind my ear and braid downward. And um, I personally like to leave a little bit of wispies out towards the front just to give it that loose, you know, pretty look. So let's just go ahead and braid real quick here. So now that I have my braids done, I'm just going to pull the rubber bands a little bit further down to the end and I'm just going to loosen up my braids to give it more of a softer look. If you braided yours all the way down to the ends, I would um, take your bands out and kind of shorten it a little bit so you can loosen it up just to get that looser look. Okay, so the next step is to have your bobby pins ready. And I'm just gonna take this one up and over. So you have to decide where you want your, your braid band to be. Do you want it towards the back of your head? Do you want it towards the front of your head? And place it how you want it. I want mine to be about right there. And I'm just gonna use a bobby pin to secure the end of it right where I want it. And then I'm gonna take the other one up and over. You can put it over the top to get it closer or behind however you want and just tuck the end of this ponytail I'm sorry braid underneath that one your other braid and just pin that in so then just take your bobby pins and Pin them, put them in wherever you need them to be, just so that they feel more secure. And I like to pull a little bit of wispies out, just here and there. Make it look a little bit more sloppy. Good kind of sloppy though. So once you feel like your hair is pretty secure and in place, I like to just take my braids and loosen them up a little bit more. Get them looking good and puffy. And there you have it. That's Milkmaid braids. So easy, right? And um, I, I have mine coming down a little bit further than some people's. You know, some like to have their ears showing and then others don't. I personally like to have mine over my ears. Um, you don't have to have your wispies. You don't have to loosen your braids if you want to make them look more, you know, just tight and just overall cleaner. It's totally up to you. But there you go. So easy, right? I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you guys want to see any other tutorials from me, any hair, makeup, whatever, make sure to leave them in the comment section below for me, your requests. If you like this and you want to see more braid tutorials, give me a 
thumbs up, guys. And uh, make sure you're following me over on Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, all of that. I'm always pinning all kinds of hair to ideas, like um, different braids and stuff like that. So leave me a comment over there, even if you want to see me turn that into a tutorial. So thanks so much for watching today, guys. So thanks so much for watching today, guys. Au revoir. She be standing next